I've been a pilot for 40 years. I hold an airline transport pilot certificate, the highest level of airman certificate that the FAA issues. Because of an unusual confluence of circumstances, much of my early flight training took place in the training department at Braniff International, a major airline in its day that was headquartered in Dallas. I know a bunch of airline pilots. I therefore consider myself qualified to speak on United Airlines' announcement that they intend to reserve half of the slots for the 5,000 pilots they intend to hire for, and we quote, women and people of color. First things first, when I say I know a bunch of airline pilots, two that come to mind are women. They're both damn fine pilots. That's because they, like every single airline pilot I know, wanted to fly from the time they were kids. So they paid the huge price necessary to earn the certifications and gain the requisite experience to even apply for an airline job. And that's the biggest single reason that riding as a passenger on a U.S. airliner today is statistically the safest thing you can do. Arbitrarily setting gender and ethnic quotas on airline pilot hiring is monumentally dumb. There are two seats in the pointy end of an airliner. You want those seats filled by individuals who got there solely on their own merit. That's my word. What's yours? Go to youtellmetexas.com and you tell me.